All right, what's up, guys? This is Crow Number Seventy Six. Um, I finally got around to uh, test uh, test. Um, this is a three D converter. It's a three D. It's an old three D Excel. I used to use it on my Optima HD sixty six, and this is what I used to use. I, it was a seven twenty p projector. And this is what I used to do to convert it to uh, 3D, the movies, as you can see here. I'm going to show you real quick. There we go. All right. So <clears throat> the question was, a lot of people were asking me that, you know, I know it has uh, the, the new uh, Optima UHD 60 has a button here that claims that it's 3d and i'll show you real quick so if i press it see it has 3d mode but then that's all it does also i wanted to tell you guys about um when okay when I got my projector back, I sent my projector to uh, to Optima because I heard something inside loose. I think it was a screw. Something was loose. I don't know what it was. They never told me. They just sent me a new one. But on my the first one that I had, um, it actually here I'll show you the the, the image settings. <clears throat> I actually I actually had uh, a vivid mode. All right, I had vivid mode before. Now I don't, as you can see. And um, I emailed them. They said they did a firmware update to where it does show 3D, but I'm like, it, it doesn't want to play 3D. So I don't know, you know, it's not highlighted. So the guy said he'll get back to me. So hopefully I could answer those questions too. But yeah, the other one, if you see my older videos when I when I when I first unboxed it and I played it for you guys, I had Vivid Cinema HDR. Now it has HDR Sim Game Reference Bright User, and it has a 3D mode now and another HDR up here, which I can't get to it. So yeah, like I said, I emailed him. I asked. I asked. He said we probably did a, a firmware update on the one that we sent to you and I was like oh okay so it probably you know it has a different setting from I don't know uh, from whatever I had before he was probably that projector was one of the first models that were out and it had that old firmware I don't know guys whoever has a a projector an Optima UHD 60 let me know if you guys have the vivid mode but I went back and checked my videos and I used to use vivid mode on it. all right um, but yeah the 3d didn't work um, like I said I hooked it up I lowered everything all the resolution I lowered it to 720p and this and that but native resolution on this projector is 2160 so it just wouldn't go any lower than that so I wasn't getting any picture, I was just getting flickering and it'll turn on and off, on and off, on and off without any luck. So I believe it will accept a 3D signal. I just have to figure out how, <laughs> you know, cause I mean, why would they have it? Why would they have that feature, right? So I'm just curious on that one. I mean, they, they have it on Um, I don't know why would they have it, right? So there you go, guys. That's the latest update. Also, a lot of people were asking me about this mix. This is the hybrid mix. I did have the door open. Here, I'll show you. And it's really sunny out, out, in, out today. But this is a hybrid mix, guys. It's not ambient light rejection. It is my, my lightest mix. Um... And people were asking me about the prices, but most of you already know it's 65 a quart, or for now, 100 two quarts. Two quarts will paint up to 200 inches, 
one quart will paint up to 120 inches. One coat, okay? And yes, it's for all my mixes. Because <laughs> people are asking me if, if it changes from, uh, you know, because you get a darker mix, will it be more expensive? No, it won't. All my mixes are the same price. All right, I also do have a 100 inch flexible material. Um, I did have uh, three 150 inch and I had five 120 inch. Uh, those are sold out. They, you know, I am getting more, but uh, you have to ask me. And like I said, you know, just ask me if, if you guys don't want to go out there and, and, and get some material. I mean, I'll give you the price. Like I said, one uh, 100 inch with uh, with one quart will cover it, like with two coats, and there's no problem. And I think I was giving it for 100 inch just till the end of this month, I believe. So there you go. Like that, you don't have to go look and you know shop around. You just get it done. Comes in a package. It goes on really good. I will be painting a sample so you guys could check it out. All right. All right. So there you go. If you have any more questions, let me know. Uh, hit me up. But yeah, that's the latest update. I couldn't get that to work. Um, and I was like bummed out. I was like, dang it. I thought I figured out something new. But no, I guess it has to be the same resolution or something. You know. All right, guys. Thank you for watching and I will see you later. And for those that I know you're going to ask, has it, does it work with a 720p uh, Epson? I tried it. It doesn't. You know, it doesn't. It has to have the feature. You know, it. it I, that one was just for, like I said, the Optima HD um, 60. So, 66. I'm sorry. So, there you go. All right. Guys, have a wonderful weekend. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.